Hello, everyone. I hope you and your families are staying healthy and safe during these unprecedented times. It is indeed my pleasure to meet with you virtually and update you on CAFE's fundraising efforts for this year. I'll provide an update on our most critical project, the Justin and Jaylor Center for Wine and Viticulture. As you know, Cal Poly's Wine and Viticulture Department is uniquely positioned as the only undergraduate program in the U.S. that teaches all three facets of the wine industry, viticulture, enology, and the wine business. Our faculty and our curriculum are preparing our students to be leaders in the wine industry, poised to solve challenging problems around water, climate, labor, and competition from other beverages. Because our learn by doing teaching approach, we have grown to be the largest undergraduate program in wine and viticulture in the country with over 300 students. The department's rapid growth over the last decade has put a strain on our current facilities. Our small pilot winery and current enology lab are not serving our students or our faculty needs. New state-of-the-art facilities, including labs, full-scale production winery, and spaces for the community to come together with our students and faculty are needed in order to help us continue to produce top talent for this industry. The Justin and J. Lore Center for Wine and Viticulture will provide us with the education environment needed to enhance our standing as the best wine and viticulture program in the country. This new center will include a teaching, research, and production winery, providing our students with a learning space that is similar to what they will operate in the industry. And the Grange Hall will include labs for enology, viticulture, and sensory analysis, as well as office space and a large conference hall where industry, the academy, and the community can come together to learn, to connect, and to grow together. The impact of this new facility will reach far and wide. This new center will allow us to expand our research programs, improve student learning, and engage in a more meaningful way with the industry. These facilities are critical in helping us to recruit new talented faculty members and to retain the incredible talent we already have. In addition, this facility will showcase the exciting opportunities in the wine industry, encouraging the next generation of students to learn the skills and knowledge needed to become tomorrow's leaders. Thus far, we have raised a little more than $19 million toward our $22 million goal. Looking ahead, I would acknowledge that we're in a difficult fundraising environment, and I would really appreciate your assistance to help identify additional support to help us raise the final nearly $3 million to close out this project. I just wanted to reiterate a few of the main points. Again, we have the largest undergraduate program in the Americas with 300 students. The only one that teaches three facets of the wine industry that are critically important, viticulture, enology, and the culmination with wine business. I want to emphasize the project remains on schedule despite the COVID-19 pandemic with the wine reset to uh, complete at the end of the summer in late September. And the Grange Hall is on schedule to be completed in March of 2021. And most importantly, I wanna thank you all for your ongoing support and partnership with Cal Poly and with the College of Agriculture, Food and Environmental Sciences.